a billion dead. I'm writing a novel set in a future world where a global famine strikes. The population has just crossed 10 billion people. Is it unreasonable to kill off a billion people during five years of famine? How would that scale of death be dealt with, just from a body disposal perspective? How about social and emotional aspects? It seems to me that you can directly relate food production to societal energy. So, in a time of famine, society has less energy to deal with things like death at a time when it needs all that energy. I'm thinking that people would stop caring about where loved ones were buried, and maybe there are laws mandating cremation. Social unrest is going to happen, a few years later, WW3 comes about, with this as one of several ingredients, catalyst not yet determined, and the majority of deaths will happen in places that can least handle it, mega cities in China, India, etc. Am I reaching too far with a billion dead? As an author, you can choose any level of mayhem and destruction, you only need to make it believable. I think you do that by explaining the steps humanity took to forestall the famine, and how they worked and how they failed. From our own current experience with coronavirus, we can see that the initial response is sort of disbelief and denial, followed by disease control theater so politicians can say they are doing something while panic rises. The soonest response would be the number of farmers would increase drastically, from organic, hydroponic, to chemo-fueled maximized output of calories to close the gap. And, still one billion die. Why does this fail? Disease, incompetence, contamination, a combination of all of the above. Longer term, if we were faced with an increasing number of dead, year after year, I am sure people would be concerned about where are we going put them, but the obvious answer would be that we would use them as fertilizer. And, if the famine got bad enough, we'd start eating them, both cannibalism and Soylent brand breakfast flakes, now with more grandma. So why does this response fail, or does it succeed and limit the famine to one billion dead? In the middle term, science would be furiously working to understand the famine and create GMO to counteract it. Why did this fail? Or did it save the day? Or did it make things far worse? So, in conclusion, your outcomes don't really matter, you only need to make it believable, and you do that by making it understandable.